holy grail of gouache paints, I guess, because this is the large version of HIMI Himi paints, which, if you remember, started off the whole jelly gouache craze. I know I have a problem if you've been here on my channel, I've probably reviewed every single jelly gouache paint that you could probably ever review, but I got sent these ones, so it's kind of different. Let's open up these bad boys. I love this handle as well, very sturdy. Ooh, look at all the colours, oh my god, there's actually quite a lot in here. <laughs> Why did I think this was less than this? I don't know. Okay, so you get the... The names of the colours on here, and also guys, I believe there is some metallics in here, which is absolutely nuts. I haven't seen um, metallic gouache before, I think, so... Oh, metallic gouache, I guess? I think metallic gouache, I think metallic gouache. But guys, you know what this means. It's time for an opening montage. Wish me luck. Here are all the jelly colours and metallics. We also have a row of like neon colours too, which is my chef's kiss because that's pretty exciting. Yeah, these were like quite tightly packed so they were a little bit difficult to like get out. As you can see during that montage, I had to use tweezers because my fingers were hurting. <laughs> But the tweezers worked really nice and really quick, so I highly recommend them if you get a set of these and you're having trouble opening them. But yeah, these look pretty good. You can tell there's a little bit of like oil on the top or whatever it may be. Um, so yeah, I'm just going to mix them up and get to painting. I am slowly realising that I really enjoy painting, if it wasn't clear from the beginning. I don't know why, but I love doing loads of different stuff. I love my job, my graphic design job and, you know, doing stickers, digital art and drawing, but just painting, there's something about painting that's so therapeutic, where you can just sit and chill and just kind of your mind just melts a little bit. It's a little bit like... It's a little bit like meditation in a way. Look at the way that this glittery metallic paint shimmers as well. I really thought it was beautiful. I always struggle to use metallics a little bit within my work, but this time I just thought I'm gonna have fun with it. I'm gonna add some sparkles to this picture and I'm gonna make it quite subtle because over the topness of sparkles kind of is strange sometimes, but I think it looks really pretty and I enjoyed using them. I just chilled out and I had fun with this drawing, painting. I always say drawing when it's painting. I'm really getting better, I think, as well. Like, I compare this painting to the first ever jelly painting that I did years ago now, a couple, a few years ago now, and I really feel like there's a definite style to this and the forms are clearer and I'm really liking brush strokes and certain textures and things. If you can see within like the mountains and the the grassy hill, I really like the way that you just have like a sudden brush stroke or like a strange um, shape within the paint. I don't know if I'm explaining that very well, but I really like the way the textures work in this piece and I'm really getting good at it, I think, if that's fair to say and I think it's something that I really enjoy doing so I probably said this a few times before but I think it really works out and I think I'm just having fun with painting which is really odd because I've always always tried to have fun with painting but there's always a little bit of stress there because you're like oh well, I'm gonna show this to people and I want it to be good and I think I'm getting to that level now where I'm just like I'm enjoying it so yeah there we go 
is this painting perfect? Of course not. I will always say no. I don't ever think anything I ever do is perfect, hence the average artist, eh? Um, but I really like it. I think it's pretty and I enjoyed making it. I would love to know what you guys are working on currently because I feel like we've gotten a little bit out of touch with what this relationship is because I've always thought like I like to do YouTube to chat with people and see what they're working on and share ideas and things like that and I feel like no one's telling me what they're working on recently so I'd like to know what are you doing what's up what, what's up with you <laughs> um but yeah I love these jelly paints and I I used the neon paints which I thought I was not gonna touch because you know when you're trying to do kind of a I guess classical I don't know if that's the right terminology a uh, painting and then using neons in it is a bit odd but I did I used neons to make the light and these um wheaty fields I guess they are like yellow wheat fields and I made, wanted to make them so bright and vivid that just to show like the sunniness of the day but then also have like the moodiness of the mountains in the backgrounds and I hope I really conveyed like an emotion of just like peaceful yet storminess I don't know I really like it and uh, well let me know what you guys think and again let me know what you're working on I'm just gonna let you sit and chill for the rest of this paint over but yeah really like these paints used metallic in this paint and didn't think I would used neon in this paint and didn't think I would and they worked out I also have the links down below I get a little bit of money if you buy from those links so please enjoy <laughs> and buy a little bit of money I mean like 0.01p or something um, crazy but I did get sent these paints by this by a shop on Amazon and yeah the links for them are down below like I said so thank you to that shop it's very nice of them to send me this and yeah they do they have sponsored this video but I love jelly gouache and you guys know that so like honestly HIMI are probably one of the best ones out there and the fact that it has metallics and eons in it it's pretty sweet deal so yeah if you uh, are considering buying them go for it it's pretty cool but yeah this is the image and I've nearly finished it so what do you guys think I really enjoyed this painting and I hope that you guys enjoyed watching it just a few little details left within the image and then it's done so I'm just gonna leave you till the end see you in a mo That's the final image. What do you guys think? I really like this. Um, as usual, love jelly gouache. Just think it's really nice to use and just really enjoy using it. I used a little bit of the metallics in here, um, which I quite like. You can see it shimmer. Give me a thumbs up and all that annoying stuff if you want. And uh, see you next time, hopefully. Bye.